Hey guys, your inner chakras. Welcome back to the channel, guys. If you are new, you are welcome. Today is a day of confessions. Let's make them confess. Sometimes they're good, sometimes they're bad. All right, guys. Maybe one confession will be for you, right? Like for your situation. Holy Spirit. What messages do you have for the collective? Let's see. I did a lot of things behind your back. And why do you forgive? Why do you love me? So this person could be a little dirty. They said they did a lot of things behind your back. They did a lot of things behind your back. And why do you forgive? Like, why do you love me? So they can't even believe that you forgive them for some of the crap that they do. They're gonna be shut. They're gonna they're gonna get an awakening one day. You will not forgive. And see, that's the thing, guys. When you train a dog, because when they're little bitty puppies, they pretty much listen to what you tell them to do. You train them well. They behave well. If you just keep them, you don't have them on a leash or anything like that, and they just run and buck wild in your backyard and pissing and itching all over the place, right? That's not, that's not a good thing. So somebody didn't train their dog correctly, right? Stop forgiving this dog. Holy Spirit, they're gonna be shocked if ever you, you know, don't forgive them. That's the thing with those type of people. I feel like I lost you, huh? Hmm, maybe you learned this lesson because they feel like they lost you. So you do forgive. But some way, somehow, you pulled your energy away from this person. Now they feel like they lost you. Good for you. Good for you. That means you're not talking. You're not taking the calls. Whatever it is you're not doing, you're not all in their business. What's going on? They did things behind your back. Holy Spirit, how dirty is this person, right? a lot of things behind your back introduce yourself person it's an empress in reverse ah. it was infidelity they cheated they didn't treat you like an empress but now they want to offer you this they, they have a new love offer because they feel like they lost you they're definitely coming in with a new love offer This person has a fear of change. Although they will cheat on you and you take them back, they really don't want to lose you because, see, they want to come back here. So they have a fear of change. They didn't really want that. Only thing is, Empress, this person, they're still in their Knight of Wands energy. Maybe that's what they were in then when they played you with the infidelity and stuff like that. But this new love offer... They're wearing their heart on their sleeve, coming in as the King of Cups, right? Wanting to get back with you. They want to be your lover again. Can you be my lover? Can you be my friend? Right? Can you be my lover? And when they were in your energy, guys, it was a um, it was an illusion. They just fed you an illusion. They did what they wanted to do, and you always forgave them because you're just a kind person, right? But now they're coming back. New love offer, King of Cups, and they're in reverse. They have a fear of change. They don't want to go on. So why do these people do what they do? And they're watching you. Wherever they can watch you at. Y'all can work together. Y'all could be neighbors. Y'all could, you know what I mean? They can watch you on the internet. Everybody has some page somewhere. Even if you post every blue moon, you may have a page somewhere. If not, then they stalking you, right? <laughs> on foot. Holy Spirit, what's going on? Things was unbalanced. They know things are unbalanced between the two of you. Because they were unreliable. They know they was unreliable. But you stood in your strength. You stood up to this person. You was bored with what they was offering you. It wasn't enough. And then eventually it looks like you walked away. Yeah, they're over here not following their intuition. They didn't follow their intuition. So you ended things. 
You ended things. You ended up walking away from this connection. You stood in your strength. What they was offering you wasn't enough. You know, all this cheating, lying, cheating, stealing, whatever they're doing wasn't enough. They didn't invest in the connection and you didn't reap any rewards. And you got tired of arguing. You got tired of fighting. You was tired of the deception. You was tired of being in competition with other people. It's not like you signed up for it. They just placed you there. Yeah, you got tired of it. Mm -hmm. Took your love back. Queen of Cups in reverse. You probably found out about another person. Queen of Wands in reverse. Knight of Swords in reverse. So this person, when they got with you, they just jumped into a connection with you without thinking, right? They was jumping into connections with anybody without thinking. So this could be you or this person was dealing with two other people. Either way, he was juggling the hell out of you. Two of Pentacles. You got Monday, she got Saturdays. I don't know. But he was, he had to get his priorities in order. And he didn't. He jumped into a connection too fast. That was possibly with you. And juggled this other woman, right? But see, you peeled your heart. Maybe you feel like you jumped in too fast. But this person is facing their judgment. They're certainly facing their judgment right now for what they did. Because now they feel like they lost you. And look at that. They want this new beginning with you. This person's healing. They're healing now. Why do people be doing these things, guys? Let's do confessions, too, to see if they're still the same person that they were. Because they certainly feel like they lost you. Holy Spirit. Okay, you can talk. You can talk, baby. My last relationship tore me apart mentally. Did it really? Or did you do this single-handedly? Because it seems like you cheated on somebody, right? Cheated on two people. Oh, look at this person. This is an a-hole. Uh, I'm good all by myself. I don't need any more problems. And you know what, guys? You should let this person sit in this mess because they're good all by themselves, apparently, right? They're still in the same energy. They're still in the same energy. Holy Spirit, clarify this. I'm good all by myself. You know what? Wrong deck. Wrong deck to be clarifying that with. Hold up. Hold up. Holy Spirit, who is this person that's good all by themselves? I don't need any more problems. God, you ain't got to deal with that. This person is tracking your every move. Didn't I tell you already that they was following you, watching you, stalking you, whatever? They say I'm good all by myself. This is the type of person that doesn't want to show their feelings. It's somebody who gets uh, manicures and pedicures. A man, manis and petties. And this person is heartless. OPP. Other people's. You know what OPP? Yeah, you know me. Now, if you know what that means, it's other people's yum yum, right? Um, this person's heartless, guys. Don't let this person back in. They're a gaslighter. Holy Spirit. Anything else? One more. There we go. Look at that. More than one woman. More than woman. Mm -hmm. More than a woman to me. Mm -hmm. And on the bottom, I'm not the man for you. Guys, don't let them tell you this twice. I am not the man for you. Okay. And there you have it, guys. That is your confession. It will resonate with someone. And if it doesn't, get ready. Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. Peace.